Hey guys. 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 <laughs> Butthole lips. Hey guys. Welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to kind of show you guys a couple of things that I have recently purchased. Um, some things that I bought in store, some things that I bought in the mail. I'll tell you where I bought them, how much they were. Um, and yeah, so let's just jump right into so it. So the first thing I wanted to talk about was actually something that I just got in the mail today. It's kind of the reason I'm making this video, but at the same time, I mean, there are other things. But still, I got this in the mail today and I'm so excited. Okay, so we all know the brand ColourPop, right? I haven't even opened this. It's like still in its package and ready to be opened. Just like my fingers are like, Ugh. So I am going to open what I bought from ColourPop and just kind of show you guys what I got. Boo boo! Here we go. So these are the first two ColourPop shadows that I have ever purchased. Um, I think they are $5. They're $5 each on the ColourPop website. I'll put a link in the down bar. And these two right here are from the Kathleen Lights Where the Night Is squad, but I only wanted these two shades in particular. Um, I might end up buying the other two if I just happen to really, really like these because I do love the other two shades, but I've never actually purchased ColourPop shadows before and I wanted to give them a try first. So the shade right here is called Weenie. This is Weenie right here on the back of my hand. It's not hard to see. They're so pigmented, so buttery, so creamy and soft. And wow, I can't, I really, really can't wait to try this on my eyes. Look at that. It's just like gleaming. And the next shade I have from the quad is the shade right here. I think it's coming off a little bit more purpley but it's actually more of like a purple brown color they're so soft guys oh my gosh look at that, look at that pigmentation. Okay. so this is Porter right here on top right here on top of weenie and they're very complementing colors of each other super nice super pigmented Wow, I'm so excited for these. ColourPop is so cute. They give you little messages. Like, can you guys see that? They give you little messages when they send you packages and stuff. And they're just so freaking cute. They're like... Take all my money. Are you kidding me? Just take all my money. So there's one more thing that came in the bag. And this is actually a liquid lipstick that I ordered. I have... Never tried, again, I've never tried ColourPop's liquid lipsticks. This is the first one that I've purchased, and it is in this shade right here. It's called Chili Chili. And I bought it because it looked like a taupey brown, um, reddish, mauvish color. It's on the very top right here. It's very pretty, very pigmented. But yes, so these swatches are going to be on the back of my hand for the rest of the video. So the next product I want to talk about is actually a foundation that I have not used yet and I'm hoping that soon I will be able to get up a first impressions review on it and it is the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Healthy Luminous Makeup Foundation. This is in the shade W3 Nude Beige uh, but I know this foundation has been out for a really long time but it does say new on the cap so I'm not sure if they reformulated it or anything like that. But, yeah, it's just the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Foundation. And I've heard reviews talking about how it's a very medium coverage, which is fine. I do like medium coverage foundations because I like to be able to build them up to the coverage that I prefer because I usually prefer a more full coverage foundation. But, um, yeah, I'm just really excited to try this out because I'm always looking for dewy foundations that are, like, that have a nice coverage. And... This one's kind of cheap. I think this one was, I think this one was $12.99 maybe, $11.99. I got mine at Walgreens. 
So the last thing I wanted to talk about is new from the drugstore. I know it's new. It is a Wet n Wild product, and Wet n Wild has been coming out with a lot of new products lately. They've put out brushes. They've put out um, a bunch of new things. And what it is, is this guy right here, and yes, I have used it already. I don't know if you can see that. I think the light is hitting it weird. It's called the Wet n Wild Coverall Correcting Palette. And I haven't really dipped into much of the other colors. I haven't really dipped into the yellow or the purples. Solely because I don't really have a lot of under eye circles that I need to correct all the time. But, this green, this green right here, I'll swatch it for you. I won't swatch it, but I'll let you see it on my finger. You put it on a red spot and then you blend it out and it just gives a green tint to your skin to cancel out the redness. And I find this incredibly helpful because I'm, I'm always on the hunt for full coverage foundations, but with this, I don't really need to be on the hunt for full coverage foundations. Um, the way I've been applying it is with a foundation brush. I don't actually have mine right now, but it's just a flat foundation brush. And I will dip it into it and kind of like, kind of push some of the product up. And then I'll like dab it on there and then I'll just like pat it on my face. And then I'll blend it out a little bit because it does stay where you put it. So you do have to blend it out a little bit if you want like, if you don't want to be like green tinted. <laughs> um, but I do have redness in my cheeks and I deal with rosacea and this just really helps a lot. And I've been using it under my Makeup Forever foundation every day since I bought it, like last week I think. And I've noticed a big difference in the way that um, my makeup looks on top of it. And I will say that it doesn't affect the consistency of your foundation or I don't find that it affects the consistency of my foundation. It goes on just as smooth as it always does. It's the Makeup Forever foundation. Everyone knows how good that one is. But yeah, I just, I really feel like this works. I, but yeah, those are just some of the products that I wanted to mention. And also, I wanted to give a quick shout out to these boots right here because these are so cute. These are so cute. I ordered them off of shopparts.com. I will put a link in the description if you would like to check them out. They do have some really, really, really cute stuff. And these are called Chelsea Boots. And I was looking online. <laughs> I have a story. I was looking online. And every time I would come across a pair of Chelsea Boots, I'd be like, oh, those are so good. And then I'd look at the price. And I'd be like, maybe they're not that good. They'd be like, three and four hundred dollars and I don't have three and four hundred dollars to spend on a pair of shoes. These were forty eight dollars I think with free shipping on shopparts.com which is incredible. These were specifically cheap and I was like I want them so I bought them and I love them and I've been wearing them like all week because I don't have shoes. So if you like this video and you would like to see more like it, uh, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys!